AMEs might ask, why is it important to correctly assign time limitations on a certificate? The time limitation for either a special issuance or an AME-assisted special issuance are clearly shown in the authorization letter provided by the FAA. Frequently, AMEs do not provide the not valid after date, which is printed on a pilot's medical certificate. When this date is missing, it must be corrected and the certificate reissued by the FAA. This takes additional time for processing and contributes to delays. Failing to monitor certain medical conditions is a risk to aviation safety. An AME will also receive an administrative error for this oversight. So how does an AME avoid the need for corrected medical certificates? First, ask the pilot to bring a copy of their authorization letter to the exam. Then, when you are issuing a certificate, select the appropriate not valid after date under limitation 76 in AMCS. You can call your regional flight surgeon's office with any questions. For more information, please consult the AME Guide.